David Zritsky for the Bond Experience. All right, I've got champagne. I'm wearing an N Peel cashmere shirt, and I'm standing here with my best friend, Joe Darlington. Sorry? It's a good day already. Cheers. Uh, cheers, brother. Joe good Darlington from, from Being James Bond. What are you doing here? James, being James Bond. It must be, a, must be a James Bond day. It might be a James Bond day. This is uh, one of these days that we go traipsing through New York City, creating havoc, and N Peel cashmere has allowed us to come. What yeah. do we got here? We got, oh my God. We're, we're playing here. We've got stuff from No Time to Die, For Your Eyes Only. It's a fun day already, isn't it? It's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's great. And we just started drinking champagne, and it's 10 a.m., but uh, it adds a sparkle to the day, doesn't it? It certainly does. Yeah. Mr. Rosado says so. Because he likes a healthy chest. He certainly does. It's, it's interesting how you had me say that. <laughs> like I was trying to trap Joe to say that. I'm, I'm being good, it's early. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the day's young. All right, Joe, let's let's talk a little bit about kind of the, the whole idea. This is a, a state of the union. Mm. All right, so with that in mind, we are a few months away from No Time to Die. Are you feeling good about that we're gonna get a movie this time? Yes, yeah, I, I feel like at, at this point, I, I don't think anything, I, I haven't heard of anything getting postponed in quite a while, so right. I feel like at this point I've got no reason to think that this is not going to go forward. I'm with you on this. Yeah. I mean, I, I think, you know, and I know it's different all over the world. I want to pay homage to the fact that in different countries, this is an international audience. You are still in lockdown. There are things that you can't do. But I think everybody's moving in the right direction here mm. in the United States, for example. Um, you know, we can actually touch human beings, <laughs> yeah. which is uh -huh. so freaking cool. And yeah. I love that. And we're amongst our friends today, which is so much fun. Mm -hmm. But let's talk about a couple of things because, you know, there's been a, a bit of a, a wonderment around what are we in store for in the next month or two? Are we going to get trailers? Mm. Like, what, what do you think is going to happen? Uh, boy, that's, that's, that's a great question. That is the million dollar question. And I'm, I'm very curious myself to see how they go forward. Uh, I, I, you know, we, we, one of the things we talked about months ago right. was the idea that we've already seen multiple trailers. And I think to the, to the point where we, we all sort of said, okay, I've seen enough. I don't want yes. to see anymore. I, I don't want, I, I'd like some secrets. So I, I, I'm hoping that they're pretty tempered with the marketing yeah. I, I hope we get um i'd like to see a resurgence of the commercials and the trailers that we saw already yeah uh i'd love it if they w w can do that without putting out new material because they feel like like i said we, we, we kind of got enough good point good you know? point uh but it, it'll be very interesting to see that kind of ramp up again yeah and 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 i, I have a hunch it's going to be like let's just pretend we didn't do that before let's pretend this is all new which is fine by me i I'm with you. Yeah. So I, I have a wish, and my wish is that they don't start to add all these new scenes to get people, because first of all, it pays too much deference to the, the crazy fanatics that, mm. oh, you've seen everything, as opposed to the very casual person that, quite frankly, just needs the old trailer to come out. Right, and, right. And here's the thing that worries me, and I will be frank with you. Um, I hear grapevine murmuring, and you mm -hmm. know how accurate the grapevine is. Uh, grapevine murmuring that we might have a trailer in July. Really? And yes. And what I'm hoping is it's not two minutes and two seconds showing all new things to say, look, yeah. right, there's right, so right. much more we can give you. I've seen enough. I'm sold. You yeah. have my ticket money. Yeah. Uh, right. Exactly. I mean, honestly, we're we're all gonna go. We're going, and I don't think. Right. I I've heard people sort of make the argument. That the, the film is three hours and you've seen two minutes of it, calm down. Um, <laughs> that's one thing. But if you're seeing, the, the problem is that if you're seeing tiny little snips of every scene in the movie, then, right. then I mean, that, that's what it's about. Play the numbers game then. If you see five seconds in two minutes, that is <clears throat> 185 scenes. Right. That math is totally wrong. Right, right. I'm not a mathematician, but you've seen a lot. Is what I'm right, saying. exactly. I, honestly, I mean, I mean, I we all have seen trailers where by the time you've seen the trailer, you might as well have seen the entire movie, frankly. Absolutely. Um, so, right, I, I'm hoping that there's plenty, and I and I'm pretty confident that there's still plenty of surprises when we see this film. Yes. Um, in fact, I, I I'll be shocked if we're not. I'll be shocked if we're not shocked by some of the things that are going to happen in this movie. Yes, and even, you know, we're here amongst NPL, and I'll just say from a brand standpoint, you know, so many people that follow the Bond lifestyle mm. in general have said, oh, we've seen every outfit. I don't know if we have. I think there are still some surprises 
left in store. So mm. I think we're going to have more Bond style moments. First of all, he's he's clearly married at some point, maybe not married at another point or, mm. you know, canoodling. <laughs> So we're going to see them kind of relaxing, yeah. and we may see a couple extra pieces. I don't know. Yeah, no, very true, very true. I, 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 I'm with you. I'd be surprised if we've seen everything, because there, there is an indication, and one, of the, one of the things I'm very excited about. I, I always like the films that seem to take place over a span of time. You yes. know, um, the ones that are kind of like the like the 48 hours in and out and and very quick and we're done. I, 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 I they're fine. Okay, right, but right, the ones that I I, I notice this about myself. Like if it takes a little time to sort of tell the story, yeah. I t tend to respond. And I have a hunch this one's going to do that in spades, frankly. Oh, I think yes. we're going to see a, a length of time. You have a significant so, jump, right? Yes, right, exactly. So I, I, And plus, I, I like that they're showing us some downtime, some relaxation time. I love uh, those moments. Those, yeah. So you and I cut from the same cloth. We love those moments where you can have a quiet Bond moment. Yes. Sit back. It yep. doesn't need to be bombastic throughout the whole thing. Exactly. Yeah. So, all right. Let's move a little bit from will we, won't we get a movie, I think we're pretty determined that we will get mm. something, to a really big question because I think that, you know, people like you and I, content creators, have been keeping the flame of the Bond community alive. And it hasn't been easy, but yes. It hasn't been easy. Yeah. Why hasn't it been easy? Well, it, it's, it, well in, in some ways it, it's been, well, I'll, I'll say this, it's been rich and rewarding it's been fun yes, yes. uh the creative the, the, juices flow. yeah yes. i mean honestly i can i can honestly say that we did not spend 2020 just chilling out in our pajamas waiting for the whole thing no. and we, we we were pretty active and we did a lot of stuff yeah and it was fun i mean we had a great time doing yes. it uh that said i i think it has been kind of a an uphill battle rolling that boulder up the hill to try to keep everybody excited uh, for the film. Because again, I mean, we've had, I don't need to say it again, but we've had how many delays and, and we had delays within delays. I mean, yes. we had, I mean it, was, it was delayed multiple times before COVID. Then we, we, we had multiple we, delays during COVID. We've talked about it akin from a cartoon standpoint to the Charlie Brown, Lucy football. Uh, right, like, exactly. I'm like, no, 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 this time I'm gonna hold the football. Arr, 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 right. arr. Yeah. To, to the point where it was getting to be like, Every time you heard a new date, it's like, am I going to fall for this one again? Yeah. Is, is, am, I, am I really going to get invested and in this? the answer this? is yes. You're right. Well, I, we are going to fall <laughs> right. for it. So here we are looking at October, and it's right. like, okay, no, okay it's, it's like, we're not kidding this time. We're really going to get a new movie. So what do we do to, to, to kind of get that excitement back up? Right. Excitement that we've already, I mean, again, the, the, as fans, I think we're, we're feeling the same struggle as the marketing team. We put yes. out all our trailers. We put out all our posters. We did it all. So are, do we just do it again and pretend like that didn't happen? Do we whatever? Yeah. So so here we are. Like so so what do we do to get to get amped up for this? But, but somehow the, we will. We but, will. And yeah. but you're you're nailing it because I think, and I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm actually gonna pay respect to the Bond fans, the three C's as I like to call mm -hmm. it, the consumers of content. The contributors of content, mm -hmm. people that just come on shows, yeah. and the creators, you know, people yeah. like you that actually create it from scratch. Mm. Because we've created a groundswell of material yeah. that people are drinking in yeah. with and around the movies. Yeah. And, and I yeah. think this has been a wonderful, and, and listen, I'm not trying to say this is like making a, you know, a lemonade out of lemons, but the, the wonderful side effect of COVID is that we had to dig in and create our own entertainment. Yeah, yeah. You know, the lights went off and we had to, you know, do puzzles by candlelight. Yeah, yeah. So I love that aspect. My yeah. question, Joe, is come August, when the Bond brands, when the commercials, when the machine starts up, mm. are we going to be able to celebrate as fans those moments? I got no clue. I have no clue. It could get better. It could get worse. I, I mean, no one, all of our guessing to try to sort of get, stay right. one or two chess moves ahead has been futile, has been it, so... It's so tough. It, it's, been, it's been a really weird thing. And again, it, none of us have been through this before. No. So it's no one's fault. It just is what it is. So, so for us to, to sort of try to predict, you know, what's October going to be, I got no idea either. So, um, but... 
with that said, yes. if, if we at least sort of just look at the tra trajectory we seem to be on, I think we're in good shape. I think things are getting better. People are getting vaccinated. I see half masks on, half masks off. People are kind of, we're kind of in that hybrid yeah. sort of sort of thing at work where we're kind of a couple days in, a couple days out. Yeah. So I, I think we're kind of, we seem to be moving forward. So I think in one way or another, yeah. October is going to be pretty damn fun. So I'm gonna throw something newish out at you. Mm. So there's a lot of murmurings. Love okay. talking about murmurings, because what else are we gonna do but speculate? That um, September 28th is the launch of the movie publicly in the UK, mm. okay? And UK is going through its own, you know, interesting variant discussion right now. But a couple days before that, there will be probably a premiere. And so the question now comes up, and I know this has been a discussion amongst all of you out there as well, Plane rides mm. from different places mm. to the UK to celebrate. And I say that celebrate as opposed to go to the premiere because it's very difficult to go to the red carpet premiere. Uh -huh. I mean, you've got to, I don't even want to get into it. I yeah. mean, you've got to know to know to know. Mm. And it's very difficult and you can't really pay your way in, which right, is maybe right. the right thing to do. And by the way, nobody even knows um, despite speculation, hmm. where is it going to be? Is it going to be Wembley Stadium? Is it going to be a small venue? Is it going to be an online Zoom, God forbid? Ugh. Hmm. But Joe Darlington perspective, if there is something in the UK to celebrate and go to and you are allowed, will you be there with your friends amongst this premiere? By the way, we've got somebody uh, off camera, Harris, right now going, <laughs> yes, yeah. So we know his answer. What's yours? Uh, I, I, oh, oh, I see well, it's, it's, it's interesting. I, I love how, how you sort of prefaced the whole thing. You were like, this and the other thing, probably. And I'm like, hmm, well, there you go. Um, I, I totally hedged my bets. <laughs> right, <laughs> seriously. I'm thinking that's, that's a maybe. That's committal, yeah. <laughs> um, I, I tell you what, I, I think it, it, as long as things kind of keep going the way we're going and things are going to happen, I, I think I'd be hard pressed not to go. Yes. So um, I need my brother there. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, we'll I, do a Patreon I, thing. Can we do a Patreon thing? Do do like a like a GoFundMe to try to get yeah, yeah, get, yeah. get Joe over get, to uh, get Joe first class on, a, on an <laughs> airplane to. Uh, uh, yeah, listen. I I I think um, I, I I would probably. I'll borrow your word. Probably. I I I, I I'd be I I can't imagine a scenario where. Things are going to happen. Things have opened up. We right. can do a normal yes. celebration. And Theaters, I'm, everything. Yeah, yes. yeah. I, I don't see a scenario where where that happens and I go, nah, maybe next time. Because, yeah. I mean, again, I, I sat there and watched the premieres, the red carpet of the last two films over live stream, and I was just like, you got to be kidding. How, how am I not there? So I, I don't see me doing that again. Right. So That would kill you inside. I, I think so. It's a, a small death, yeah. yeah. So uh, I, I think one way or another it's going to happen. So in the meantime, I think what we need to do is look for those opportunities where we can celebrate together. We're here in New York, for example. Mm -hmm. And, you know, even though we're whittling down on... What the <laughs> heck is going on here? You, you know, you never know what's going to happen. And this is what we talk about with a celebration. Jo uh, do, do you mind if I pull you on here, sir? Hold on, we've got... Your Thank you, sir. Your champagne, sir. Get in here. So, unbeknownst to us, we got we got another brother from another mother. <laughs> what are we talking about? How are you doing, Harris? I'm fantastic. We're talking about the whole idea of a state of the union, of no time to die. We talked about is it going to happen, and then we talked about the celebrations like we're doing today. It's Father's Day weekend when mm -hmm. we're filming this. Mm -hmm. Happy Father's Day. Thank you, sir. And and for for your um, uh, child as well that you don't claim, um, I. Wanted to find out from you, Harris. He's not just pouring champagne and drinking, drinking from the bottle. bottle. Yes, like a baller. <laughs> um, what about the celebrations leading yeah. up to it and including? Yeah, I mean, just like you, what you guys were saying, uh, let's go to London. Let's get yeah. out of this country. Mm -hmm. Let's get back to normal. Um, I feel like an old uh, broken record or whatever. You know, we had a week planned uh, we that did. got taken away from us. Norway, <laughs> Paris. Oof. Monte Carlo? Monaco, Nice. Oof. I mean, what are we talking about? I know. Let's get back to that. So, yeah. yeah, I just hope that we can all be in a situation where, you know, we can all as a Bond community celebrate yeah. No Time yeah. to Die and drink Fort Bollinger. And by the way, even protect. It's the 007 one. It's the 007 oh, one. Oh, can I have this bottle I mean, when we're look, done? 
Seriously. You, know, you don't I need the 007 <laughs> one. So you got this imported from the UK. You don't go to Enfield you can't get this here. in Madison Sorry. Avenue and get I'm not editing change. any of this out, yeah, by the way. Absolutely not. I'll, you ask for Alexa and her team, they'll take care of you all the time. By the way, um, um, and, and one of the things that we hope for is maybe in September, we're drinking Bollinger with the people of NPL over in the UK as well. Shout what do you out think? To them. Mm. Well, you know, it's a great team. I'm going to go back and refill my glass. Do it. Do it. You guys don't throw that bottle away. Yeah. It's a collector's piece. <laughs> You saw a real moment here, folks. We don't we don't do cuts or anything like that. We're total geeks. Joe, with a parting thought. Um, first of all, I want to toast you again. And I'm toasting you. We got to take a sip. It's bad luck not to. Um, you have been one of those individuals that, and I, and I get emails like you get emails where people, you know, have become redundant. You know, people um, their chins down. Uh, people have been despondent through this whole thing. And yeah. you have been one of those individuals that said, you know something, I'm not feeling great either, but I'm gonna get up in the morning and I'm gonna do a video on ranking the Bond women. Or I'm gonna talk to David about the man with the golden gun. Yeah. You've kept people motivated in the Bond community and you've helped to create the solidarity of the Bond community. Yeah. Why? Why was it important to you? Um, I, I Probably a lot of reasons, but, but honestly, I kind of felt like you're absolutely right. It was a tough year for everyone, and, and it, a lot of people just sort of said, well, what am I going to do about it? Do I sit around and mope, or do I pitch in and try to make this kind of as bearable as possible for a lot of people? Yeah. I, 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 in 2020, I probably did get into probably goofy comedy sketches, <laughs> frankly, which in we some of my loved, videos. Yeah. Which we love. I mean, and I had a ball doing it, so. But you're right. I mean, it was, yeah, I just, it was... I enjoyed doing it. It was a lot of work. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. But um, you yeah, did it I mean, the for time you, was, but you did it for others too. Absolutely. Yes. I mean, that's it. I mean, we're all in this together. I mean, that that yeah. is absolutely the 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 over the overlying theme of the whole thing has yeah. been. You know, we're all in this together. We're, you know, let's let's do what we can to help each other out. And um, that was my tiny little contribution. And I gotta I say that. too, I mean, it's worth saying that there was a lot of people who who also jumped into the fray. You know, I mean, they I feel did. like we've seen a lot of new new creators explode and grow. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it's a, it's a good time. I mean, that's the thing. I mean, I kind of feel like just in terms of summing up the, the state of the union, you know, mm. it, I think this, this last few years has been the best of times and the worst of times. Ooh. It's been tough, but a lot of people have really did rally and, and try to make the best of it. I'm not even going to try to, to one-up that. that the, the man is a poet. Joe, Didn't thank you it. so much for coming on. This Here's. has been great. We're going to enjoy the rest of the day uh, without video. Imagine that. <laughs> uh, but uh, who are you? Joe Darlington being James Bond. I'm David Zeritsky from the Bond Experience, and we'll see you all real soon. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Thanks for watching this episode. If you want to be up on the latest from the Bond Experience, just click on this subscribe and subscribe to our channel. You're going to get all the latest and greatest information, plus some exclusive content. And by the way, speaking of content, here's something especially for you, just because we know you. Talk to you soon.